Hey everyone, I'm Jay. Today we're watching the 11th episode of Vivi, Fluorite Eyes Song. Last episode, uh, Vivi is now in the museum. Uh, can't sing because Diva's no longer there, it's just Vivi. So all she can do is show the passerby's clips of her performances, which is kind of sad. But uh, yeah, she befriends this one kid and decides to compose her own song. And come to find out, this kid is actually Matsumoto. Either the creator of Matsumoto or the the cube itself. Not sure which, but it's like, that is fascinating. And, uh, yeah, I'm curious to see where this goes. So, let's do this. Three, two, one, go. I'm very excited. Very, very excited. Yes, the timelines. Yes. Oh. Mm-hmm. Don't know who's gonna loop right back to the original. Oh, there's a lot of possibilities off that one. Countdown. Countdown. Oh. What? Oh my god. <laughs> nice. Holy moly. Oh. <laughs> That's so bad. Yeah, that's what I'm curious. Why? Uh huh. Today's the day. Well, that's fun. Okay, okay, it did fail. All that work failed. <sighs> Meaning. So if everything we did was for nothing, I mean, that puts me to the assumption that everything that happened was irrelevant. Something of this was going to happen on that day, no matter what. Making it someone incredibly high up. <sighs> Would it be them? I mean, because there was a commenter who said, maybe this is Vivi's song that caused this. But did Vivi write this song in the original timeline as well? And I don't believe she did. 
Man, it's shocking that everything they did was for nothing. So who would actually want this? That's the question. Because I assume it's a bug in the system. It's the only thing that makes sense. It's not like... I can't imagine all AI just turning like that, you know? It just doesn't make any sense to me. Worlds and modulation. Ho, 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 ho. Are you serious? Oh. What's crazy here, it seems like it's one robot to one person. As soon as a robot takes out a per or AI takes out a person, they're done. That's Masamoto. Mm-hmm. Sing that song. <laughs> bonk. <laughs> Cute bonk. <laughs> Your project worked. Mm hmm. <laughs> All right, he was the creator of the cube. If allies, I'm assuming they're alive. Tuwak is their allies now? Okay. When did that exactly happen? My god, this is awesome. Oh, yeah, the flying balls. It's like, <laughs> yeah, one person per uh, flying ball, flying surveillance camera. Oh, this is fantastic. Oh. 
going, yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, Vivi, you are awesome. Nice. <laughs> oh Uh <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> This timeline's Vivi? She looks like Vivi. Oh, God, yes! <sighs> I can't believe I couldn't stop it. So the question is, who did it? <laughs> I say, yeah, you the one in control. How did she end up in charge? You're right? Doesn't make any sense. Oh, it's Elizabeth. God. They look so similar. <laughs> Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. 
Okay, nice. Oh, she looks a little taller. <laughs> I remember him too. What is today's date? All right, 40 years ago. Oh. Hmm. Oh, uh, QB talks way too much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. I say that's nothing. I thought it'd be in the millions by now. There was an event. Was it his creation of the Singularity Project that caused this? I think it was the creation of his project that caused it. Almost like a self-fulfilling prophecy there. He thought something bad was going to happen, created something to stop it, but that was when it well, actually created it in the first place. Oh. Oh, that's awful. And I love it if that's the case. Mm-hmm. Yeah, what about in the original? Were they also singing a song? Because I do not remember the first 30 seconds of the first episode. Right, right, right. That was an amazing fight. Mm -hmm. 
through. Uh huh. Oh, that's all it is. Oh. So it's the archive. It is. Okay, 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 okay. So that was the cause. The updates caused it. Did the archive become self aware? It's going to crash a satellite? Wait, isn't Vivi always in this place? Because it looks like the place she always goes to. Alright. Confirmed. And what's the reason behind it? Oh, we need a reset. Planet needs a reset. That's usually... Uh... Or often a reason given. Wow. Freaking wow. Left bike. Indeed. Oh my god. Okay, so they're using the, the friggin' tower, the archive, as their judge to see like oh hey if it stays short it's not a problem it's gigantically tall right now so from the time she was put into the the uh the i want to say the library but it's not the library <laughs> why is the word escaping me right now the museum till present time that tower just exploded in size then right because they hadn't really actually shown that though hmm I totally thought that was, like, another version of Vivi. But if that was... No, because it couldn't have been Vivi, because Vivi would have been still in the museum at that time. So there's no way Toak, excuse me, could have had Vivi. So uh, my thought process was mistaken from the get-go. Definitely a character I did not expect to see again, because I thought they went down with the sunrise. So that was interesting. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not watching this preview here. That will ruin everything, because, oh my god, this is amazing. Holy cow. <sighs> this is 12 episodes, right? I gotta look now. I gotta look now. It's 12 or 13. Vivi, Vivi is 13. Okay, so there's two to go. Two to go, thank god. Because there's only one, I would have been incredibly sad. There's only one left of this, because... Okay, so. Things that are happening. Yeah, everything did was meaningless. Because the Archive planned this from the get-go. Everything they did meant nothing to the Archive. Because the Archive is this... Is, like, AI central. Is, like, the the core of the AI universe, right? 
like all the aggregate data from all the AIs come here. This is where they get all their updates, all their computer updates and whatnot. And at some point they became self-aware. It's my assumption. It's usually a self-awareness to where the robots turn, at least in fiction, that's where it always comes from. So that's what I'm putting it on. And it happened on the same day, both timelines. Meaning it was just going to happen. It was the day it was going to happen. Did someone plug something into the archive to make it happen? Did someone corrupt the archive? And so, who had the power to do it? Because Vivian Matsumoto took care of those people in this timeline. At least we assume they took care of them, so... Interesting. Yeah, it's freaking great. I love everything that's happening. I cannot wait for next week. Let me know what you thought. Bye-bye.